because something that's interesting to me is that like I think that there is a valid conversation to be had about doing employment background checks. However, um, not hiring somebody because they do OnlyFans. You could argue that hey, I think the corporation should take a stand and say we don't police our um, individual employees' backgrounds. Now you can say that's unreasonable. However, when corporations turn that same lens and they get very woke about employees, you conservative people get really upset about that. For instance, if 10 years ago you tweeted about being a Nazi or whatever, or you tweeted edgy jokes, you guys would stand up and you'd go, hold on, corporations shouldn't be holding employees accountable for stuff they said on their Twitter 10 years ago, but it sounds like if somebody found an OnlyFans you did 10 years ago, you'd be saying, well, it's totally fair game to make it so that that person can't work at that yeah, company. Yeah, doing OnlyFans is worse than saying that. That's not a fair argument. Okay, well, one because, at a time, let's go. Okay, okay, so let, let, me, let me just say mine real quick People are getting easy. fired from their jobs for saying something is gay on Twitter 10 years ago. Or sure. like yeah. making, which, which, making a mildly reason, homophobic but hold on, but hold on, joke. But we said That's a totally different thing than like a no, 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 no. national socialism. No, no, or something. it's actually totally not. Because what if it is the case that your salesman is doing business with another company, and let's say that the person that they're interfacing with is gay, they find out that your salesperson tweeted homophobic stuff ten years ago, and now you've got like an, uh, a blue chip company that doesn't want to do business with you because you hire hire people that have been homophobic. They could use the exact same argument that you use about not hiring the OnlyFans people. Now, hold on. To be clear, I'm not saying that we should fire all those people. I'm just saying that back in my day, okay, we didn't. Have peruse all the online history of everybody to decide who gets hired or who's not. I think that if you're not on the clock, then the employer shouldn't have anything to do with your shit. Yeah. But it is interesting that we were very selective about what we want policed in a person's history. Yeah, and that's how you this goes back Starbucks to the original to point that I was making earlier in the conversation mm -hmm. about homosexuality contributes to the degeneracy of society. I want to live in a society where you can joke about something being gay online. Sure, but it, it could be a racist joke. Oh, come on. I'm saying gay, but it could be like a racist joke. It could be a bigoted joke. It could be a whatever edgy joke. It could be a, any type of thing, right? I'm, is or that it could TOS? Be, is it TOS? What? To say that homosexuality, is that TOS? I don't know, but your podcast is going We're down. We're in California, tonight, don't, don't worry. <laughs> Just tell us when the stream goes down and move the rumble. Sure, sure. Okay, hold on. 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 Hold